everybody, Chris Lino here with IPD, and today we're going to talk about ignition components. The unfortunate part about ignition components is that they are a wear item. And for over 60 years, IPD has been instrumental in helping IPD customers and Volvo owners around the world with taking care of ignition components, identifying what ignition components that are great to work with their Volvo engine, and IPD has also developed some exclusive parts to help go above and beyond with premature failing or ignition components that work underneath hotter conditions. When I was a kid and I started here at IPD, we had regular people come in every day that owned 140s, 122s, and 1800s. And that was a complex ignition system, right? That's why I had a dwell meter, a timing light at my desk, and I really had to know the proper way to set those up. And IPD was here to help those people that did wheel call or walked into our office to get those cars running efficiently. Things have definitely changed, but that's why we're here to talk about what components are right for your car and what can you do to save money while doing preventative maintenance on your own Volvo. As I mentioned before, ignition systems are a complex system. We might think differently now. We've had to change our paradigm around what is convoluted or complex. Let's talk about earlier Volvos. If you've been around like I have for a long time, and much of you have been around a lot longer, but for my 30 years, I've seen Volvo's ignition systems change dramatically. Like I said, when I started here, I had a dwell meter and a timing light at my desk. We had customers that came in that had talked to us about setting up their distributor cap, their condenser points, all of that needed to be adjusted manually in order to optimize how the car performed, determining what condition that you drove the car under. You may be a hot rodder who wanted it to be at its peak performance. So maybe you would time it a little bit differently, but you had to set it all up manually. Things have progressed naturally over time in the automotive industry where now things are being done automatically or done electronically. Over time, Volvo started using electronic ignitions where you didn't have to set up the points in the condenser, but you still had to mess with the timing. As we got a little bit further along, cars started going to crank sensors. Crank sensors were picking up directly off the crank so that way you didn't have to worry about your timing or even setting up a timing light on those vehicles. Things have progressed even more with direct ignition and that's what we're gonna talk about. IPD is always here putting that information on our website or even in our old catalogs, helping our customers determine what is the best setup or the right plug or the right spark plugs or the right components that is directly related to their specific Volvo model. IGD's commitment has always been to Volvo owners looking to maximize all the components on their car. Now in relation to ignition components, ignition components are wear items. So it's given IPD a lot of access to helping upgrade components. We also offer replacement parts like Bosch. We have OEM replacement parts for spark plugs, spark plug wires, anything that is related to the ignition side of things. But if you wonder why IPD manufactures our own parts, it's because we're familiar with the parts that do prematurely fail. And our commitment is to saving you money and being able to lengthen the amount of time that you can get the most performance out of your car. And when I talk about performance, it always means more horsepower. It just means maybe you want to lengthen the amount of time that you have these types of wear components on your vehicle. A lot of components in your ignition system are wear items because they're directly related to heat. Heat wears on items. It's taking a charge from a coil, which is pushing it through spark plug wires, a coil wire, distributor cap, condenser, points, depending on how old your Volvo is. All of these items are wear components. As Volvo progressed into newer ignition systems, a lot of those components started to get streamlined. So you're not having as many components that you have to replace. But that doesn't mean that there aren't components that are wearing, like your spark plugs. Even with the earlier Volvo, spark plug wires wore out, coils wore out. With the newer vehicles, we're starting to see direct ignition coils wear out. And we'll talk a little about that and what you can do to prevent some of those failures from happening prematurely. You may hear the term jump the gap out there in forums or blogs or even on our own product pages. We've written many articles about spark and jumping the gap. When you have wear components like spark plugs, ignition coils, ignition spark plug wires, and distributor caps, it's all in relation to jumping that gap. When wear items happen like spark plugs, and the amount of gap that's there on the end of the spark plug, when that wears out and that gap becomes too much, it requires more force, more heat to jump that gap so your Volvo can run efficiently. When that happens and those gaps are too big, it generates more heat. Your Volvo is trying to combat that gap by running more heat through it because it's got to produce more of a charge to maintain the ignition side of things on your Volvo. And that's where the wear comes in and corrosion starts to occur. The main components of your ignition system, like spark plugs, still require scheduled maintenance. Back on the older engines, vintage cars and red blocks, even the early white engines, 
you could go 12 to 20,000 miles before you would check the gap on a spark plug. Now Volvo recommends on their newer Volvos that they can go nearly 100,000 miles. But being here at IPD and being the Volvo specialist, we see these things failing at around 60 to 70,000 miles. How do we know that? Because we're seeing other components fail due to spark plugs that are worn out. For over 60 years, IPD has been providing our customers with information on how to save money and do the proper preventative maintenance in relation to ignition components. And sometimes IPD created products that would actually last longer underneath those extreme conditions. Nothing has changed in the past 60 years because we continue to do that today, even on the newer modern Volvos. What we have found a similarity between the older vehicles and the newer vehicles is that spark plug maintenance has become even more crucial. Back in the day on the older vehicles like red blocks and vintage cars, when spark plugs wore out, you would have more wear on the ignition components like the distributor cap or condenser or points or whatever it was internal on that ignition system that was running more charge to jump the gap. With the newer vehicles, they run a direct ignition system right over the spark plug. And those direct ignition coils are not that affordable for most people. But that's why IPD has gone above and beyond and created a new coil that's able to withstand hotter temperatures and more charge. Because when your spark plugs actually do wear, it requires more of a charge from your coil. And what happens is when those spark plugs do fail, we've seen significant amount of failures in ignition coils. What we don't want to happen for you is to have to pay, spend more money on failures of coils because your spark plug might not be within the correct gap. If you've been a part of any of our recent videos, we have covered ignition coils and this recent discovery on how there has been a massive failure on ignition coils when spark plugs are overlooked. Again, the proper gap, even though Volvo has done a fantastic job with their spark plugs by using new alloys, those spark plugs are able to last longer underneath extreme conditions that are being monitored by the Volvo's ECU or ignition control modules. But that doesn't mean that they still can't fail. It just means that they pushed out the spark plug intervals and changes a lot longer. Like I said earlier, Volvo recommends changing some spark plugs up over 100,000 miles. If you've got a car that's working in different kind of climates or you're running a tune or you're running something a little more performance based out of your Volvo, you definitely want to pay attention to your spark plugs more often so it doesn't lead to spending more money on other components that will fail all at once. Nobody likes to spend money on a big batch of coils or direct ignition coils, but IPD has created ignition coils that will last longer under hotter conditions. Even if the spark plugs aren't optimal, we will be there for you to be able to help get through that.